Good morning, guys, and welcome back to the off-grid cabin build series here in North Idaho. It's snowing out there, guys. And look at that. We've got a hole in our door here. What's going on? Today's the day. We're installing this bad boy right here. Hopefully, we'll get it done. We'll see if we run into any problems. It comes with pretty detailed instructions, though. Look at this, guys. See? Bam. Tons of instructions. So... Even a newbie like us probably could figure it out. You're gonna need one of these though. It's a sill pan. Now you can buy them, right? Plastic ones. If you watch a lot of uh, different videos on YouTube, they've got plastic ones that you just put down there, glue together and it's done. Well, they didn't carry those at our store. So we had to go with the instructions. Bam, look at that. Tells you exactly how to make it. That's what we've got right here, right? So we're ready to start putting this guy down right here. Well, we gotta cut open the opening. Yes, sir, that's what we gotta do. So we cut it at an angle here, this will fold over. Uh, this right here we cut off flush because it's actually gonna go up and wrap around. We'll tape it up. You'll see that when we get there. Whew, check out all that snow. Now we're committed, man. We gotta get this thing done today. So what do we gotta do here, man? We gotta clean this up a little bit from come walking in and out of it. We broke it off a little bit. So we'll just clean that up a little. Whoops. Trusty knife. Yeah, get that cleaned up a little so it's not bulging out the seal pan. Cause the seal pan actually folds over this thing. Okay, so we got that cleaned up a little bit. Let's just dry fit, dry fit our sill pan. Oh, come on, buddy. Oh, there we go. There we go, squish down in there. Well, that's a nice snug fit, huh? Man, that fits good. Oh, look at that. Here we go. And so basically, this line right here, this is gonna catch. And that's how far it needs to go in for the door, hopefully. We'll see. We'll dry fit the door, of course, before we glue this thing down and before we put on the um, rubber self-adhesive flashing as well. At an angle like that, this side over here. All right, hip that guy up out of the way. Yeah. Now we can dry fit the door. All right, dry fitting the door now. We got the pan in there. Jules is out to help. Let's go. So pick it up and we'll set the bottom in. Maybe we need to pick it up from the bottom, huh? Thank you, Seth. Okay. Woo! Good job. I think we're gonna need a step. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna need some stairs, huh? All right, Seth, just kind of put your finger in here and just kind of hold it. Nice. Yeah. All right, let's cruise inside and see how it looks, huh? Look at Joel's, and she looks cute today. Always. So cute. I look the same as I always do. I know, but it's snowing, so you look cuter. Oh, yeah, wow. Look at that, man. We got a door. Woo. Good, man. We got enough space on the sides. Top, this side. Hold on. We've got, uh, it's good. It's a good distance, too. Look at that. It's perfect. It's perfect down there. Okay. Thank you. Jules is perfect, man. Yes. What do you oh, think about that? I love it. <laughs> All right, the door is good. Take it back out and get everything ready. It's best if we check the instructions, huh? Three parallel lines of silicone. Okay. Seal pan. Oh. 
going in. Nice. When I take my desk out of the room, I want to take off the light thing. Yeah. Um, can I like unscrew it and take it off? Or yeah, I... you can unscrew it from the desk. Okay. But make sure that the cord's unplugged. Right, that um, there's no that there's no power to it. Okay. Jules is cleaning up our mess. I said our mess. It's really my mess. All right, so we got that done. That's good. Now we need we need to fold this. I'll show you here. All right, this needs to be folded over. It's getting chilly out here. Okay. All right. Let's see about that. Next step. Um, we need that black tape. Right here. And maybe a towel to dry this stuff off. A towel? Yeah, like a, a clean clean rag maybe to dry it off. An overlap over that. Yeah, it's gonna be good. Double protection. We're gonna try to do it all at once, it's dangerous. I wouldn't recommend it unless you're highly inexperienced like me. This stuff is so sticky. If it sticks to itself, might as well throw it away. Does it go on as far as we can on the metal? Uh -huh. Okay. Yep. Probably be good if you could get your your hair dryer. Oh really? Yeah. Could you grab that? Uh huh. Okay. Thank you. We're gonna heat it up a little bit with a blow dryer. Let's see if we can't. Uh, get it to stick a little bit better this is an important one right windows may not get that much rain on them but a door like this and be walking in with wet shoes water's gonna get on there for sure oh so slippery oh it's warm it's nice set my knife down somewhere i don't know where hit that that this doesn't seem to be that kind that you can just stretch out over it so you kind of have to cut it and then put a patch in there it's just kind of lame but that's what we got so that's what we're using all right so we put our patch on here that we'll end up cutting it a little bit here but not all the way down because it will stretch some just doesn't stretch as much all right bam yeah sealed all right all right time to cock for the door. Whew. Wow, okay. nice catch. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'll put some in here. Hey, Dad, how's that look? Good. <laughs> That's a good, that uh, fits good. Thermals. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm like boot around the neck. Yeah. Like, the sleeves actually really aren't that long. Now you're ready for the snow. Open the silicone. Oh, I forgot. Puppy. Puppy. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. Let's um let's try to kind of even it up before we slide it in. Okay. How much space you got over there? Finger. The finger fits? Yeah. All the way? Yes. I just want to finger down. Yeah. yeah. Okay, that's pretty close. <laughs> Go ahead and slide it in. Time for shims, huh? Yeah, try to even it out here. And, uh, okay, so maybe a fat one and a thin one. Almost perfect. Seth's Hi, moving guys. in. <laughs> nice. You're almost all the way, huh? 
huh? You're almost all the way in. Yeah, just cool. a little bit more stuff. Good job. Thanks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna put it right in between the two here. Let me just shut the door real quick, okay? Goodbye. Okay. <laughs> Hello. Hey guys. All right, so we're gonna put it right here in the middle. Yep, right there. That's just about perfect. Cool. Okay. Put one up here towards the top in the middle. Right here. Okay. All right, that looks good. And check it out. Doesn't want to open or close. It just stays right where it's supposed to stay. That's good. All yeah, right. Yeah, it's pretty balanced then. We gotta do that, that side of the jam. All right, last one going in for now. Beautiful, huh? Yeah. These are the doorknobs and deadbolts that we got. A four pack. That way, when we put the front door in right here, eventually, they'll have the same keys on both doors. So that's good. So let's go ahead and open it up here. It says it's a one tool installation. My guess is that's a Phillips screwdriver. Whoa, wow. All right, so there's no instructions. <laughs> we got doorknobs. We got the part that goes in the door. And I don't know what that is. Oh, that's okay. Cool. And then we got that and the deadbolt. What else we got? We got screws. We've got longer screws, keys. Check out the keys, huh? Pretty standard keys, household keys. Cool. Four keys and four people in our house. All right, let's go see what we can do. There are instructions after all. Jules found them in there. Looks big too. Wow. I didn't know there was so much instructions. Maybe they're in so many languages that, that could it's be. bulky. <laughs> oh, it's got um, like a parts breakdown. Huh. All right. Cool. Look at that. Instructions. <sighs> Lots of them. Alrighty. Let's go put it in. The door looks like it's already set up perfectly for these things, right? I mean, it just fits right in there perfectly. You want bunks up or down, Jules? <laughs> I want whatever the book says to do. Did, did I read the directions? No. You guys know better than that. What do we need to read the directions for? I'll I'm, tell you what for. I'm definitely a direction reader. Because when you mess up... Then you're kicking yourself because you didn't read the directions. That's why. <laughs> but this is just a couple screws. So if we mess it up, we can always take it back apart. Let's see here. We've got... This is for the deadbolt. Hey, look at that. There's pictures on them, man. This is for the deadbolt. All right, we got to go get the different screw pack. <laughs> okay, while you're doing that, I'm going to look and see what... All the noise going on. <laughs> it's Sarah. Hi. She's moving in. Yeah. <laughs> wow, your room is getting full and fuller. Where are you going to put your bed at? Right here. Okay. Yeah. That's a good idea. Inside it wall. So close. <laughs> Seth's been helping a lot. It's cold outside, man. Mm -hmm. Snow stopped, though. Yeah. Stopped snowing almost exactly when the weather said, huh? Yep. Well, that didn't work out as good as I was hoping. Man. All right, so look at this. Bam, baby. It works. And when you lock it, it doesn't work. It doesn't work from the inside either. So unlock it. Nice. Again, these are already all routed out for it. 
So, yeah, right there. Perfect. Beautiful. Look at that. Think it's gonna shut good? Yeah. I hope so. I hope so. Let's try it. Bam! Ooh, nice. Look at that. Good job, babe. Dude, it works. <laughs> All right, so for the deadbolt, we got the bolt part and we got the two halves right here and the uh, striker plate, I guess you call it. Gonna pack screws. That's why I like this O light so much, this little guy. Clip right on your hat. Let's see what you're doing really good. All right, so let's check it out here. And let's see, which way do we want this? Yeah, that's oh, upside down. It's supposed to go this way. Well, well, let's get that guy back out of there, flip it over. Perfect. Maybe uh, we should put those screws in there, huh? It's like opening up a uh, spoon packet in some restaurant. Wow, look at these guys. Long. All right, I got these little guys here. Hold this thing in. So we got this guy here, goes in. It's not like the most secure thing. Like, would it be easy to kick this door down? Oh, absolutely. But this is, uh, it does have a big glass window in it. So it'd be super easy to just break the window and unlock the door. But there are ways to secure your door, to harden it. Maybe later we'll do that. All right, guys, check it out. Bam, we've got a door now. Look at how much snow we ended up getting today. Not much right there. If you want to see what else is going on here on our homestead, how we are dealing with winter in an unfinished cabin, there's a video right over there that you might like to go ahead and check out. Otherwise, guys, I hope you have a really great day. Keep smiling. And I'll see you right over there in that video in just a second.